a ship from the planet Endermount was approaching Earth. The planet's alien blocking field was overcome by the impact of the ship's plasma energy, causing severe damage to the vehicle. This was their first expedition outside their system. They were amazed at the strange planet that was opening before their eyes. There were many oddities on this planet. The first thing that caught their eye was that it was heavily polluted. Overnight the aliens discovered more than 20 different life forms most of which looked like organisms created from toxic waste. Many buildings and structures were destroyed, and many buildings looked abandoned and empty. Traces of machinery and robots could be seen on the surface of the Earth. Despite this, there were human beings on the planet who had adapted to life in such conditions. They were the remnants of races that had survived the global catastrophe that had befallen the planet. The aliens were interested in collecting donor material and energy from the sentient beings that inhabited Earth. Through this they sought to replenish their powers and through genetic experiments breed a new race of helpers. 7, 6, 5 Our dreams have collapsed, as has our ship. We can't get out of here. We are stuck in time. We managed to get to this planet. Looks like we're in for some fun. Yes, a strange place at first glance. Again they whine. And I'm interested here. There must be a lot of life here. Let's focus on the main thing. The energy of life. That's why we're here. Local residents should become our donors. Everyone get ready. In case of aggressive actions, open fire. I wouldn't hunt here. Hey, Hunter. You will not be able to sit out on the ship. It's time to go out to harvest. The victims are waiting in the wings. We need new souls. You know my rules. I don't hunt the weaker sex and their offspring. When the battle is fiercer, call me. It's the captain's directive. We are all obliged to follow his instructions. And you too. But if you are tired of your role, you can transfer to the laboratory with experimental animals. We just don't have enough workers there. That's it. I will not hunt with the vultures but I will cover your skin if the locals open fire on you. Mechanic! Get ready to beam down! Laser cannon on alert! Keep communicating through telepathic channels! I'm all set! We're going down! Hold the block! It's going to get crazy! An ocean of hopelessness. How far do you have to fly from here to forget everything that happened before? I saw her through the portal of worlds. Her name was Soraya. She was reading a book about the stars. Sadness lived in her eyes always. I haven't seen her for a long time. Oh, it would be better if we never met. The voices are calling me. The hour has struck. These messengers from distant stars have come for me. A new path awaits us, new skies. We bring peace and true freedom. We want to help you escape the burdens of the past. Come to us. We want peace.
Captain Jason wants us to have peace. Here seems to be the first victim. She looks like a weirdo. But not without soul. Bring her to me, Kofin. You can see that her soul is suffering. We must help her. A poor girl. Even a little sorry for her. Oh. Life energy is now too much in demand. They want to kidnap you to take your soul. They need your energy, your strength, or their reserves will be depleted. Your soul is their power source. But it's up to you. You have the right to refuse. Your soul is priceless. If they take it, you'll be gone. Hey, rescuer of the doomed! You're out of luck this time. Your new fling is more obedient than any of the others. She's one who goes to the net on its own. I have to admit that clever preaching is as good as brute force. Well, I don't mind. I'm not a retrograde. Tell you the truth, I don't envy her. Not of her, not of you. You alone went against the main order, and that is punishable. Those who follow us will gain gifts and freedom. Those who push away those who seek us, who block their way to our footsteps, are doomed to perish. Come to us, Soraya, and you will find peace, freedom, and everlasting peace. I have to come to them. They need me. They have chosen me. I will give them my powers, and they will open to me the glittering expanse of their worlds. A voice told me that I was chosen for a new life. Yeah. The fly flew to the spiders. I'm willing to suffer so that she doesn't die. Soraya, covered by the veil of illusion. You must not fall so high. I may be considered a traitor, but I'm not going back to the ship. The smell of freedom and malt and whiskey draws me harder than mortal combat and the fat pay of booty. That's what I needed. The wind of freedom. Cheers. We'll get the traitors. None of you will hide from justice. You will face the judgment of the council if you live to see this day. Strive for harmony. To peace. Space will not accept those who hate the Earth. Love life and each other. Love the light, and it will illuminate your hearts. Spirit is eternal, but matter is vulnerable. Live in the spirit and your bodies will find new souls. May love be with you, Mary. Peace cannot be held by a mere desire for peace. Peace is based on love and mutual respect, and contempt for wealth and power. Earth creatures have rejected these laws. The laws of the cosmic order. We, too, once lost peace. But first we lost love and respect for one another. The great compassion inherent in our civilization left our hearts. So time, space, and our enemies, caused us irreparable damage. We were forced to draw our energy from other beings. Eventually, the rulers of the Tkas system, a system of total cyberactive consciousness, took over us. We will not follow you. 
Even the most fallen will not sell their freedom if we fight. And we will fight. And in the end, you will have to go. So don't look for your supporters among us. Don't be ridiculous. We have already found thousands of supporters among you. We promised them power over you. The temptation of power is stronger than a thousand others. Be firm in your choice, Maria. Get off our Earth. Do you destroy your planets, want to destroy our world too? Go back to your own. We won't let you take over our world. Bravo! You want us to clean up? We'll get out. But first we'll take you with us. We need slaves and donors. Which of these roles are you and your clan considering for yourself? What do you think of it, Maria? We took refuge on your planet, but we did not harm it. On the contrary, we helped you to overcome the consequences of your own deeds. Now our common enemy wants to take the last thing from you, your freedom. We cannot stand aside. We will fight together. But we are not strong enough. We need all thinking people to follow you, Maria. You were chosen by the Earth. You are the only one who has kept her spirit of love within you. Jason, you must defeat them. Launch a secret program to reactivate mutated biorobots. Yes. We will obey the Council's orders. Reactivate. It's time to bring the cyborgs into battle. In the name of the Supreme Cyber Council, I order a laser attack on enemy objects. to the end how do you like my gun pretty boy don't you dare ask for mercy we must protect our earth our children Stubborn battles, battles continue in Area 35. 
The Clan Alliance has announced support for the Resistance. This is reassuring to all who care about the fate of our Earth. Wait for the next news! I'm proud of my people. They are not afraid of anything. Aliens have better guns. Let's go to their side. Maybe we will get something. Mom, I'm not afraid to die. I'm afraid to forget everything. Farewell, my love. We tried our best. Kiss your daughter. Destroy them. afraid to deal with these beasts. I hope the Earthlings have a sense of self-preservation. Otherwise, they're all dead. They sent cyborgs against us. We can't do without help from the Clan Alliance. It's up to you, Sordan. I'm ready to help. We'll ask the Union to vote for. Regardless, my commandos are at your disposal. Promises to be a hot day. Let's give them a meteor shower. I heard you, pussy. Charging asteroid catapult. to repel our attacks. Our cyborgs have been neutralized. They're storming us. We have to retreat. You failed the operation. We will report this to the Council. The only thing that will save you from self-destruction is the many donors that you have stolen from this crazy planet. We are waiting for you back. You fought hard! You deserve all the respect! It is a pity that we could not arrive earlier and prevent these bloody battles. But your sacrifices are not in vain. They will serve the cause of peace. Long live Mary! Yes, long live the Earth! We have lost our people. We have lost the best. Will their children live in a better world? I don't know. But we must change our lives, change ourselves. Otherwise, it will not be wars that will kill us, but our own ignorance and malice. You saved our world, Maria. People followed you and found unity. End of operation! Let's go! Everyone return to the ship at once! It's time to get out of here. I told you it was crazy. We'll be back. We will definitely be back. They always start a massacre and then run away. We got out on the emergency engine with the help of the center-activated infragrid infrazones. Otherwise, we would have been surrounded and destroyed. Barrett's the only one of us left on Earth. And that's a good thing. He'll probably find the home of his distant ancestors. 
I couldn't leave Soraya. If we die, we die together. Besides, Coffin already filed a report on me. I'll face trial and execution, at best, or at worst, dematerialization and the incorporation of my genes into some new bioseaborg. The only thing I have is eternal space and Soraya. It's worth living for, even if you don't have much left.